Okay, my name is Leah. I'm a singer and a songwriter and a recording artist. I am from Bulgaria, but I've lived in Boston for about six years. And about myself, I, I write music. I graduated from Berklee College of Music a year ago, and now I'm just focusing on writing music, releasing new music, and performing whenever I can, when there's not a global pandemic happening. <laughs> <laughs> okay, my name is Francesco. I'm from Italy. Uh, I'm a guitarist and recording artist as well. Don't call me sugar. I can be the poison in your... Mother Medusa was uh, written by me and one of my friends, Ma Maria Landy, she's like an incredible songwriter that I love to write with. And it was produced by an Indonesian producer called Abram. And the song is about female empowerment. It's a, uh, it all comes from the myth of Medusa, which everybody would tell you that she's a scary monster, but I think she's a badass. And I think that she's a symbol of female power. And we wanted to write a song about that. And yeah, that, that's pretty much it. So the lyrics play with the metaphor of the Greek mythology and Medusa and everyday female struggles. And the music we wanted to do with the entire project, a mix of dark and colorful so that's why the visuals and everything is uh, very colorful yet it has these like snakes and more darker imagery as well as the production it's pop but it has a lot of dark uh, sounds and creepy synths which Abram was incredible in doing and everything the whole project we just wanted to be uh, contrasting and the lyrics are the same way it has these uh, metaphors but yet it's like very playful and the vocals are playful and yeah We actually have been playing for a long time yeah. together. I love playing with Francesca. Yes, I love playing with Leah. Yeah, we do a lot of acoustic shows mm -hmm. we've done in downtown Boston. Like we had one show that was a, a stage on in downtown Boston, like on the street. There was a stage, and we did that. We've done Played live few shows. so far. Yeah, we've done so far shows. Uh, yeah, I just love playing. With yeah, same. Always You're a pleasure. Just lying, but it's okay. <laughs> Hang on tight, we're gonna get through this uh, and keep creating. I guess that's the most important thing because even though all of our live shows are canceled and you can meet with in person with people, you can still collaborate over Zoom. I've been, this pandemic, I've spent writing a lot of music on my own as well as uh, with songwriters that I love over Zoom and it's been great working with, I actually uh, worked on Mother Medusa during the pandemic. I recorded the background vocals in my closet because no studios were open. <laughs> And we worked with Abram who was in Indonesia, so we had a 12 hour time difference. We had a 12 hour time difference and we still were able to communicate either early in the morning or late at night. And it was fun. But in general, I guess what I would say to young artists like disregarding the pandemic is just take it one step at a time, dream, dream big, dream really big, but then don't look at the end goal. Don't look at your like, I wanna be a famous artist. Don't look at that, start small and just w walk your way up there, that's what I'm doing. I'm taking my small steps, so. <laughs> yeah, I agree with what she said. I think enjoy the process is one of the yes. best thing to do with music because it's like a never ending process. Um, yeah, and there is the, during this time, it, it was a little bit hard to be, to stay, you know, creative, but I'm glad that we, we have music and, and in this day we can, you know, connect all over the world, as she said, you can, collaborate with people all over the world. So that's kept me very creative. Yeah. Enjoy the process. That's a yeah. good that's a good advice to give. Because we're always focused at what we want to become mm -hmm. and we never like stop and think what we're actually doing right now and how yeah. cool that is. I'm working on recording a lot of, I've been writing a lot, so I have a lot of done songs. I just need to work on them and hopefully in 2021, I'll be releasing more stuff. Yeah, what about you? Yeah, Francisco? so uh, I've been released one tune like lately, it's on Spotify. Yes. And also I have my own project uh, called Rocket House. We write like funk instrumental music and yeah, looking forward to play with singer like Leah and keep doing yeah. good music. I'm excited for live shows to start at one yeah. point. Like I understand it's totally fine that there's no live shows right now. I completely understand. 
but I'm so excited for it to happen soon, hopefully. To see our future projects though, you know where to find us. Instagram, mine is leahofficial underscore, and that's L-I-Y-A, official underscore, and you? And mine is fra underscore stach, so F-R-A underscore S-D-A-C-C-H. Just Fra follow us. <laughs>